Hello, I'm Bernard Hickey from interest.co.nz and welcome to 90 at 9, brought to you in association with the BNZ. This is your morning briefing where you get everything you need to know in 90 seconds at 9 o'clock, starting now with news just in from Fonterra of its monthly internet auction of milk powder and prices are down 13.7%. This is partly because of increased supplies onto the market. Remember, prices have risen sharply in the last year or so, and many farmers around the world have increased their production to try and take advantage of those increased prices. But of course, as increased supply hits the market, prices fall. Now, Fonterra has been saying up until now it's expecting to pay out $7 a kilogram in the current 2010-11 season, and has actually suggested an $8 payout if prices remained high and the currency remained low. However, with this big drop in the wholesale price of dairy products, we may not see that $8 a kilogram. That's obviously bad news for our export sector and many of our provincial economies. Meanwhile, in Auckland, another big property developer, Tony Tay, has gone into liquidation. Overseas, the UK government is preparing a contingency plan for the possible collapse of BP. There's also talk that Libya may look to buy BP. Talk also in the States that actual sales of petrol at the stations owned by BP, and there are 11,500 of them, are down 20% because of consumers in the US are protesting at the big oil spill in the Gulf of Mexico. I'm Bernard Hickey. That was 98.9, brought to you in association with the BNZ.